Hello, Mr. Edward Rickers. In preparation for your presentation at the 2021 UNESCO DC Met Chair Symposium, thank you for participating in this interview. Please tell us about yourself. Uh, yes, well, my name's Edward Vickers. I work at uh, Kyushu University in uh, Fukuoka in Japan, uh, where I'm professor of comparative education. Uh, and I, I'm shortly uh, to become uh, our inaugural chairholder of the UNESCO chair in education for peace, social justice and global citizenship. Um, my research focuses mainly on uh, East Asia and in particular Chinese societies in East Asia, uh, looking at the history and politics of education in contemporary Chinese societies. Great, thanks. And what are your concerns right now about your country or region? Uh, well, perhaps my biggest concern relates to um, relationships between China and its neighbors in East Asia. So I'm based in Japan. Uh, I've always been interested in and concerned by the state of the relationship between Japan and China and the, uh, uh, the role that education plays in shaping uh, or reflecting the state of those relations. Uh, and I must say that, that the situation at the moment in this region gives me particular cause for concern. Uh, so I guess that's one of my biggest concerns right. uh, uh, amongst others. For example, right. yeah, climate okay. change and so forth. Exactly. Thanks. And and what are your current sources of inspiration? Well, um, I'm currently working on a, a project coordinated by the Mahatma Gandhi Institute for Education for Peace and Sustainable Development in Delhi, uh, which is um, uh, a, a sort of review of the state of education globally. And uh, partly in connection with that and partly out of my own interest, I'm reading uh, Mahatma Gandhi's um, famous book, Hind Swaraj, uh, where he talks about the, what he sees as the true nature of civilization. Uh, his views about the differences between Indian civilization and uh, modern Western industrial civilization. And I don't necessarily agree with everything he says or writes in, in that book, but I think that the uh, skepticism that he expresses there about uh, industrial uh, modernity and um, the values that underpin it uh, are, are very pertinent for us today, you know, as we look at the challenges of climate change, uh, as we look at um, the, the sort of viability of uh, developmental statism <laughs> in Asia. Uh, I, I, I think um, rereading that book is uh, providing me certainly at the moment with uh, a certain amount of inspiration. Great. Well, thank you very much, Mr. Edward Rickers, for this interview. Thank you very much.